of the elect, you're going to come into this. If you're not of the elect, you're wasting your time. Because we're not trying to save black people. You want to get saved amongst the other blacks? Go up to Harlem, man. And listen to ISUPK, man. Okay? This is only for the elect. The most is only dealing with the elect. Plain and simple. Okay? Go ahead, I'll read that. But when someone attacks you, when someone comes at you with a club, when someone comes at you with a rope, when someone comes at you with a gun, despite the fact that you've done nothing, he tells you, suffer peacefully. <laughs> Pray for those who use you despitefully. Be long suffering. And how long can you suffer after suffering for 400 years? To bring about the complete independence of people of African descent here in the Western Hemisphere and first here in the United States and bring about the freedom of these people by any means necessary. That all men are created equal. That one day on the red hills of Georgia, the sons of former slaves and the sons of former slave owners will they be able to sit down together at the table of brotherhood. I have a dream that one day even the state of Mississippi, a state sweltering with the heat of injustice, sweltering with the heat of oppression, will be transformed into an oasis of freedom and justice. I have a dream. <laughs> My four little children will one day live in a nation where they will not be judged by the color of their skin, but by the content of their character. I have a dream. With its governor having his lips dripping with the words of interposition and nullification. One day right there in Alabama, little black boys and black girls will be able to join hands with little white boys and white girls as sisters and brothers. I have a dream today. Because we're up there to protest a bill they're trying to put in to keep us from carrying guns. Ronald Reagan is over here on the big front lawn. I got a statement to read. The Black Panther Party for Self-Defense calls upon the American people in general, and the black people in particular, to take careful note of the racist California legislature, which is now considering legislation aimed at keeping the black people disarmed and powerless at the very same time racist police agencies throughout the country are intensifying the terror, brutality, murder, and repression of black people. Ronald Reagan is escorted off the lawn by the state capitol police. I says, we can go inside somewhere. Isn't there a spectator section? I have these black panthers up here, but I'm going to set the floor. Wait a minute, now wait a minute. Wait a minute. Am I under arrest? Am I under arrest? You place him under arrest. Am I under arrest? Take your hands off me if I'm not under arrest. Am I under arrest? I'm telling you to take your hands off me. 
they put trumped up charges of conspiracy and felonies on everyone who went in to exercise a constitutional right and said they had no right to bear arms in a public place. The uh, California Penal Code Section 1220 through 12027 and also the Second Amendment of the Constitution guarantees the citizen a right to bear arms on public property. <laughs> the Lord, but if Israel doesn't exist, the white man must know something, man. He must know something. Well, the white man taught you. Yep. The white yeah. man taught you. The white man set up your your leaders, your masters, your master teachers. Yep. In his universities. In, in his universities, man. Yeah. Under martial law, whatever the, whatever the president says becomes law. Whatever edict he makes becomes law. Like the chip. They make it mandatory during the hour of martial law to take that chip. It becomes law. Nobody can gainsay it. Nobody can go with that constitution bullshit. Because during martial law, the constitution is out the window. All right? See, these people don't know how the system works, man. The law said there's no remedy. Because... That's the bottom line. The Lord has warned you now. The Lord is stretching out his hand to, uh, to grab you elect and pull you in. And the rest of you, the Lord said to hell with you, man. There's going to be no remedy when that time comes. See, they don't believe it because they're not seeing it. They're not, they're not uh, actually feeling it. There's going to come a time where all hell is going to be in this country, man. That's right. And then you're going to be looking for answers. And you're going to be thinking about all the different philosophies and you're going to go down the line. Well, let me go in the back of the Oh, Jesus, help me. Yep. Oh, great God in heaven, help me. Yep. You still get fucked up. This is only for the elect. The Most High is only dealing with the elect. Plain and simple. This is only for the elect. The Most High is only dealing with the elect. Plain and simple.